A Girl's Guide to Love and Magic by Debbie Rigo is a fun, realistic-ish novel set in present-day Brooklyn. The best day of the year for Sicily is when the Caribbean culture and West Indian Day Parade takes over her neighborhood. There's fantastic food, music, and she waves her flag of Haiti while watching the floats come down through the streets. As a bonus, this year her very cool auntie will be there, the same auntie who dabbles in voodoo and has a hit podcast. The same auntie who might just be interviewing a superstar musician that Sicily is obsessed with and who might just get to meet in person. But before any of that can happen, during a spiritual reading, a rogue spirit seems to take over Sicily's aunt, making her do things that are very out of character. Sicily knows just enough about voodoo to know she has to act fast in order to get her aunt back, especially if she wants to meet her favorite musician. This novel is a fun romp with Sicily and her friends as they try to set things back to right. Along the way, we get a wonderful tour of Caribbean culture, some background on voodoo, including how most of us think of it all wrong. Uh, this is an upbeat read that is an entirely lot of fun. Does that make sense? Entirely a lot of fun? It, 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 it's a lot of fun. It's, it's fun. It's fun. Just read the book. It's fun.